G'day and welcome back to another DB Legends video. In this video we're going to take a look at the battle gauntlet for the blue Super Baby 2 Zenkai Awakening. So if you want more details about the blue Super Baby 2 Zenkai Awakening, uh, you can see it in the top right hand corner. I will leave a link there so that you guys can see exactly what you're dealing with or what you're going to get. In terms of battle gauntlets, there are 100 stages, uh, there's a bunch of boost characters for them, and the main rewards are that you're going to receive 3000 Zenkai Awakening, or Z Awakening power, and you're also going to receive 700 Chrono Crystals. Now you get progressively more as you get closer to the top, so if you really want the Chrono Crystal rewards, you're going to have to go quite far into the battle gauntlet. You know, just getting to stage 50 or 60 isn't going to give you a lot of Chrono Crystals. There are some boost units. I'm just going to let my team be auto selected. I do have three of the best boost units, so please keep that in mind. In the shape of Piccolo, Legends Limited Cell, and Goku. Goku, you can Zenkai Awaken to improve his overall performance. And just remember, you can quick skip the first 70 stages. So you don't need to actively do the first 70 stages. You'll see a little option here that you can tick to kind of choose to skip those and the game will auto battle until you get as far as you can. Sometimes if you retry, the auto battle will clear the fight, but generally speaking, once it quiches out, you're gonna have to take over. Now, my auto battling got to stage 65. And, you know, completely honest, um, the auto battling is a lot worse than just doing it yourself. So if you find yourself quiching out at like stage 40, you can probably get to like stage 55 or so by actually manually doing the battles. Um, the scaling is a little bit kind of wonky like that. In the fights, it's a pretty straightforward fight. There's nothing too crazy that you need to do. There's nothing too wild in terms of strategy. It's not like a hyperdimensional cop or a full power battle or anything like that. There's no real, um, you know, kind of strategy or tactic. The only thing I can suggest is that if you do have a unit like Piccolo uh, who's got the highest boost, just make sure that you do the Rising Rush with that unit. By doing the Rising Rush with that unit, you do increase the damage of that unit's Rising Rush quite substantially. Uh, for me that's at least generally speaking the only big major tip I can give you. Uh, but beyond that, that's really it. Uh, you know, rising rushes, they count, they help out. Beyond that, nothing too major for me to report in or kind of give you a sense of feedback about. It's a very straightforward kind of principle. So once you're able to hit the rising rush, make sure that you hit it. Don't miss your moves and yeah, generally you should be fine. The battle gauntlet fights are not you know, distinctly difficult, at least you know, from what I have seen of all the battle gauntlets. They just sometimes can be a bit annoying and you are limited basically by your boost units. If you've got the boost units you can go far, if you don't have the boost units you won't go very far. And just remember when you are building your team, you only have three units that you need to select that will go into battle. The rest of the units can just be boost units. So you're only going to select three boost, you know, bonus boost units. The rest of your team can just be chosen of the units that give the biggest bonus. And make sure that the unit that has your biggest boost is one that obviously is in the leader slot. If you're looking at Goku, you can Zenkai him. Uh, you can grab his Zenkai power from the Ultra Rush uh, Space Time store. And that's basically where you're going to be able to get Zenkai power and kind of push him to the next level. Uh, but that's it. So that's pretty much everything you need to know. Super short and sweet. And yeah, if you've got any troubles, let me know in the comments down below. Or just let me know how things are going or how you find baby. Uh, you know, feel free to keep me updated. But that's going to be it for me. Hope you enjoyed the video and I will see you guys next time. Until then, take care, stay safe and bye.